Because if you take SAT scores alone, you correlate that with first year GPA or the propensity for them to stay in school, there is a relationship between SAT and you know, whether or not the student is retained or persists. But when you add any other factor into the equation, like what their high school GPA was or their level of participation, those kinds of things um, really take the SAT out of the equation. They're no longer adding value as to whether or not the student is likely to stay with your school or likely to succeed. 